Where'd you go, Red? There you are. Red prefers to be behind me. <laughs> All right now. Oh, I really want to see its tracks though. So this is exciting. I'll be able to try to take some pictures of its tracks in the snow and stuff. Back to where some of Sarge's food got knocked out of his bowl a few days ago. Sarge is normally up and moving by now, but with the cold, like I was saying, he'll stay in that sleeping bag. Doesn't need any water, apparently. Bird just flushed and scared red. I hear Sarge moving around. Red, you gotta go. Red, get out of here. Hey, go. Go, Red. Red, Sarge is coming out of the tent. You better go. Okay, Sarge. Come on. Hey buddy, hey Sarge, hey Red. Now Red, if you hurt my dog, Sarge! And they're off. Good boy, Sarge. Okay, well, that was probably the best outcome. Uh, I didn't personally want to scare Red. So, uh, it's good that Sarge, you know, let nature take care of things. Hopefully Red will continue to have a healthy sense of fear for humans. Good morning, Sarge. Hey, come here. Good boy. Good boy. Sarge, you protected the camp from that beast. That beast ate all your food, Sarge. Sarge, that beast ate all your food. Good boy. Good boy.